Now, last year, 47 people died during a severe weather event. And with tornado season right around the corner, we want to make sure your family's safe. And Jenna James joins us live now with another strategy that we need to know as we enter severe weather season. Jenna, good morning. Good morning, guys. Another thing we need to be able to do is monitor the weather. Now, of course, if you tune into WWT 6 News, we'll have the latest on watches and warnings for you. But if you can't get to a TV, consider keeping a radio nearby or maybe even consider this app. The Red Cross Tornado app actually has a way that you can program in your zip codes or you can do it by GPS and it will monitor for uh, weather alerts and, and alert you by uh, a message on your smartphone. Now here is that Red Cross Tornado app. For instance, one of the things you can do is sound an alarm if you need someone to find you or even teach your kids what a siren Tornado sounds warning. like. Right? It also has things like a flashlight or, let's see, that's the flashlight or also a strobe light to make sure that you can be found in case of severe weather. There's also a really cool way where you can send out an I'm safe message, type it out ahead of time, and then you can post it on all of your social media. Really easy like that. Tell all your friends that you're safe and they won't worry. Now, coming up in the next half hour, all of these strategies mean nothing if you don't have a plan. We'll talk about what you need to put into that plan in the next half hour. Reporting live, Jenna Janes, WOWT 6 News.